I mean, yeah, apparently they've been having issues at this house for the past year and a half, and police couldn't get them to stop. They've been called out here at least 30 times. Even a pandemic couldn't get them to stop from having the parties out here as well. Here's the listing on Airbnb. It reads Cliffside, $8 million beach mansion with ocean views. It lists amenities like swimming pools, tennis courts, says it sleeps 16 people. The city attorney office says they're operating without a business tax license and filed a civil enforcement action this morning to shut it down, citing the number of times police have been called, not just for noise complaints, but for underage drinking, assault, theft, and on one occasion, gunshots broke out. It's an otherwise pretty quiet neighborhood here at La Jolla Farms. People in the area just a little surprised to hear all the details about what's allegedly been happening inside, including parties where uh, at least 300 people were showing up. It, it is a little surprising, yeah. Um, you know, I, I know I, I've been trying to social distance as much as I can. It's probably hard if you have 100 people or how many there are. So biggest concern is that everyone's just being safe. and. Yeah, and Maria, the city attorney's office says it's really difficult to get properties like this shut down because right now there's no short term rental regulations in San Diego. So for the past, you know, six months to a year, the city attorney's office has been building a case, you know, against them using like fire code violations, health code violations, safety code violations. And finally, they had enough to go forward with this civil lawsuit today. Maria. All right. We'll have to see what happens with that. Thank you.